are you doing, man? Come on. This way, that way. What are you doing, man? Come on. Hey. Hey, what the fuck are you doing, man? Come on. What? serious? Phineas Clements would like to be your friend. You should check yours and see if he's trying to friend you too. Fuck that. There's no way he should be allowed to have his own Facebook page. You know what? I'll call my mom tomorrow. I'm gonna friend him. Don't do that. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm his first friend. Just please don't do that. It's gonna be disastrous. You want to hear his latest update? Nope. Okay, I'm gonna read it to you anyway. Bluffed an overpaid sucker out of 150 grand with the single hand of Texas Hold'em. They'd better lock me away, or I'm gonna leave all of Sin City high and dry. What an idiot. You think he's really in Vegas? No, babe, I don't think he's in Vegas. There's more. <laughs> I ice climbed a remote mountain in the Rockies and discovered another climber <coughs> dead in the snow. I chiseled him out of the ice and carried his frozen body to the nearest village. Okay. <laughs> I found where the buffalo roam. I speared one from my car and kept the head as a trophy. If I had a horse, I could hunt them down like the great American Indians did. Great. Sounds like he's off his medication. Hey, does he have any other friends? Nope. I'm his only one. Thank God. Listen to this. Farewell to everyone in this crappy little town. I have served my time, but now I need to head out to the West Coast and take care of the rest of my family. See you soon, baby bro. Are you all right? When was that posted? Are you okay? Yes, when was that posted? Um, two days ago. Wait, you don't think he's actually heading out no, here? No, I'm sure he's just watching TV next to my mom. Let me give her a call. God, she needs to take away his internet privileges. I'm telling you, he's gonna end up cyber-stalking somebody. No answer? No. Who are you calling now? I'm gonna try her cell. Finn. Who's this? It's Sam. Hey, little bro. Hey, are you in the car? Yeah. Where's mom? She's right here. Let me talk to her. I don't think she can talk right now. What, was she driving? Yeah, she's driving. Well, tell her to slow down. Sam says to slow down, mom. Don't yell at her, dude. Sorry, mom. All right. 
just tell her to call me later. No, tell her to call me tomorrow. All right. Gotta go. Bye. See you soon. He's in the car with my mom. God, I'm starting to get worried. Jesus, can you imagine? You have this tendency to act too cool, and you know, sometimes the client wants to talk to the artist a little bit. Okay, babe. Well, I'm serious. Your work is just as good as all that other stuff I see. You just have to sell yourself a little bit more. Okay. But the art world doesn't really work like that. If what's his name likes my work, He'll put it in his gallery. If he doesn't like it, he doesn't like it. I can't force him to like it. First of all, his name's Carl. It would help if you could at least remember that. And secondly, if you believe in your work, then he will, OK? What do you think? You look great. Listen, all I'm saying is that tonight can be your night if you want it to be. I want it to be. Look, why don't you finish up out there and I'll get ready in here. Stop being so pushy. I'm just trying to be helpful. I know. It's going to be great. That's the spirit. What do you think? You robbed the bank? Oh, yeah, little bro. Go check out that bag. We are set up for life. It's like you're saying the rich don't earn their money. They fucking steal it. I never said that. We're the fucking rich now, hey, Sam. What bank? I don't know. It's a few miles from here. Anyone get hurt? No, it was a clean job. But I got chased by the cops. I don't hear any cops, Finn. That's because I lost them. Because if you don't move the fucking car, they're gonna find us. What do you mean, us? We're in this together, little bro. We are. Yeah. You and me. Great. Jesus Christ! Get down! 
Don't see him. Don't. No, 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 that's a news copter, Finn. It's the news copter. See him? They all work together. Everyone knows set. Go move the fucking car. I'm gonna go move the car, but you need to relax, okay? Calm okay. down. Look, this is a safe house. Nobody's gonna find you here. No cop is gonna find you here. All right. All right? All right, see you. All right. She's fine. She's not gonna say anything. Okay. Will you okay. take the pantyhose off your head? Okay. I'll be back. Safe house right now. We can't stay here now. We're fucking hot right now. Real I know we hot. are. Look, we're okay. gonna be all right. We're gonna be fine. Okay. Trust me. Maybe for the night. But I hope your Spanish is good, because first thing in the morning, we're heading down to Mexico. Yeah, I don't know about that. Thing. Don't worry about it. I got connections down there. It's gonna be margarita madness. <laughs> now go move the car. Okay, I'll move the car. Okay. And give me a map of Mexico! Jesus. Christ. We're all over the place. Did he just rob a bank? Hey, no, he's delusional. I don't know what exactly is going on, but he must have my mom's cell phone. He can't stay here. He has to go. Where do you want him to go? Where the fuck he goes, just not here. They're gonna be here any minute, and he's got pantyhose on his head. I don't care, he still has to go. He's gonna ruin everything. We're gonna have to cancel. I'll call Susan and see if she can do it another night. Great idea. It took us months to set this up, and you wanna call and cancel an hour before it's gonna happen. What should I do? Call your mom. Ask her how he got here. I understand you're upset right now, <laughs> but there's really nothing we can do. Okay, he's here. He's gonna have to stay. Torch it. Torch what? The car, goddammit. I'm not torching the car, Finn. I don't trust that bitch. Stop it. You sit there and you be good. Jesus. again. Can I help you with that thing? Nope. What kind of wine is this? Merlot. What year? What's up? Hey, Susan, is there any way we can cancel? Or, I don't know, move it to another night? Absolutely not. No. Sam, this is a one night only kind of deal. Jesus, I'm doing you a favor. And you're trying to cancel on me? What's going on? Are you and are you and Jackie fighting again? No, no, it's uh, nothing like that. I just I thought another night would be better. 2009. You know, give me a little more time to finish up on a piece I've been working. No, it's too late. Besides, Carl's probably already left for your house by now, Sam. I'm not canceling with him. All right. Goodbye. This isn't very good. We should open another bottle. Just one. Oh, this is 2007. Come on, answer. I think this should be good. That's the good stuff, I can tell. Susan's already on her way. I tried to reschedule. She did not like that very much. Of course she didn't. What about your mom? I tried calling. No answer. 
What are you doing? I don't know, but I'm pretty sure all this wine is sour. I don't even know where to begin with it. Ask him why he's here. Finn, why are you in L.A.? I wanted to be with you. You drove all the way across the country? Mom okayed this? Yep. I got it. I got it. Look, I just got here, so I gotta go. Finn, look at me. You quit playing with the wine? Stop! That's Susan. Shit, what are we gonna do? We can't be in here. What should we do? Ugh. He stinks. Get him in the shower. I'm in the door. She doesn't want to cool at all the meat Sam. She's right. Let's go. Mom, I have to go. Wish me luck, okay? Everything okay? Please do not tell me you two are fighting again. Everything's fine. Then why is Sam trying to cancel? Because his brother's here. So his brother's here. So what? Well, he showed up unexpectedly no. and uninvited. No. Unexpected implies uninvited, doesn't it? Right. Get in the shower. No, you need to get in the shower. A razor. Jesus. So his brother's here. So what? What is this? A wine tasting? How much have you guys had to drink? Oh. What the fuck? Who's here? A friend. Hey, I've got some people coming over tonight. Okay? I really need you to be on your best behavior. You're doing art again, huh? Good for you. You look great in there, just right. painting your brain on a canvas. I have to sell some paintings, man. This guy yeah. coming over, hopefully he's gonna put my stuff in his gallery. You know what that means? Awesome. Yes, yeah. yes. So, can you just help me out? Just stay in the bedroom and watch TV. I'm not gonna stay in the bedroom. Sister. Yes, you are. You have to, because I told him I grew up in an orphanage. Are you drunk? No. Is Sam drunk? No, we just opened those bottles to let them breathe. Is this a cheese ball? You told me to get cheese. Yeah, any kind of cheese would have been fine. But you get a ball of cheese? A fucking cheese ball. I'm sorry, okay? I, I don't mean to be a bitch, but I am taking a huge chance with Sam. If Carl thinks his work is shit, I am going to look stupid and incompetent. By the way, where is Sam? I, I made some shit up to help sell my paintings. So, you see, I can't really have a brother tonight. Why would you lie about that? I don't know, but you need to stay in the bedroom. Are you, are you ashamed of me? No! Are you ashamed of our family? No, Finn. Why did you leave Susan? Where's mom? I don't know. She's probably home sleeping. But she's okay? I mean, everything's all right? Yeah, she's fine. We're having a great time together. I mean, why are you here? I missed my second command. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. Uh, look, why does the car smell so bad? Just go get Sam. Or something? Sam, Susan needs to see you in the studio. Okay, come on. Get in the shower. Get in the shower. No. Hey, uh, how do you turn this on? Handles! Oh, okay, I figured it out now. Hey. Susan. This doesn't look ready at all. Why is this piece on the floor? Well, it should be hanging right this here. This one's not quite done yet. Well, it looks done enough. Move it here, move this one here, and make this one ugh, disappear. No, no, no. This one, I, I like this one. Well, Carl won't. Let's keep it out. Well, other than this one, what do you think of the collection? Please don't call it a collection. You're not quite there yet. Famous artists have collections. You have a bunch of paintings nailed to the walls of your spare bedroom. And honestly, it's exactly what it looks like, you know? A few months' worth of art. I'm getting to think that my recommendation was premature. You Shit. think he's gonna hate it? Most likely. Great. No, I, I don't know. Maybe maybe he'll love it. I, I, I really... I can't tell anymore. So, your brother is here? Yeah. Don't worry. He's gonna stay in the bedroom. Okay, why would I worry about him? Why are you guys freaking Remember out? Remember when I told you he was a little weird? Yeah. Um, we'll keep it professional. Okay, I I'm sure Carl won't mind. Hey. I, I'm gonna go help your fiance. Okay. Oh, God. What happened? I just 
walked in on your naked brother. That's Finn. I'm assuming that's his name. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, my boss is gonna be here like any minute, and um, can we get him out of the bathroom and get him dressed? Yeah, I'll get him ready. I thought he wasn't gonna be a problem. Ugh. He's not. She walked in on me. The door was practically open. What? Nothing. Nothing. What was he doing? Okay, that's fine. His ball. Oh, You're joking. Really? He wasn't shaving his face. It's a favor. She's just my assistant. And honestly, I don't think she's gonna last that long. Oh, what are you doing? What does it look like? Look. Oh, Put, this Put this on. Put this on. Done yet? Yes, you are. What is that? So you're shaving your balls. Not. Thank you, Shit, not done. Yeah. Perfect. I'll introduce Carl to Sir Shave a lot. Oh, get dressed. You? Fine. How the fuck are you? Right, let me get dressed and I'll be with you in a minute. Is he for? Go, 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 go. I, I don't even. I don't even know what. <laughs> Because that's the price we agreed on. No. Anthony. Find some clothes in the closet. I'll leave the TV on and check back in on you in a little bit. Sam, I don't want to watch Look, TV. You're going to watch TV, please. No, Sam, I I'm here to help. And we, we can sell your paintings together. Brothers from Paris. I've never been to Paris, and tonight we're not brothers, remember? Sam, but we are. No, enough of the other bullshit. <laughs> You still have the razor? Come on, man. I'm not done You're yet. You're done. Is that my razor? Nope. You're fucking kidding me. Shut the fuck up. I don't want to watch TV. Hey. Let's get this over with. Right? <laughs> Hi. Hello. Jackie, Sam's fiance. It's so nice to meet you. It's nice meeting you. Oh, women's clothes. It is an honor to have you here. Thank you so much for coming. You're welcome. Can I get you some wine? Oh, no, thank you. Um, is that what your artwork is? Yes, it is. Oh, well, then, shall we get started? Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> well, I'm in a rush. You understand? Other business to attend to? They're just thankful you took the time. This one over here, I actually, I, I did an acid wash on. And, um, I mixed some oil and turpentine together and just let it drip down here. You can see how I let the red go this way. It becomes a little more transparent right here, but I, I actually, I, I used a uh, silver metallic acrylic and just poured it right here. You can see how it eats away due to the oil. And you can see the cross hatching of the two mediums. It's, uh, I mean, it really is one of my favorite pieces. I like this one, Carl. What do you think? <sighs> Sam's gonna be really proud of me. Doesn't look finished. That's because this one isn't quite finished yet. Yeah. Hmm. Then maybe it should be lying on the floor. Yeah. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Who makes these things? Would you two is, excuse me? Me and Susan for a second. Uh, I'd like to discuss, uh, you know, we could be more constructive. Yeah, sure, yeah, absolutely. Can I get well, you a glass of wine now? Just be out here. Yeah, that'd be fine, thank you. All right. Put it here. And then put this here. So, uh, what do you think? Do you think I have time for this? Do you? No. 
No. Do you think what I do is a joke? Of course not. You look like you're rich or something. I really thought that... You thought he had potential. Yes, but you're merely an assistant. Nothing more. Hey. Don't. Um, would you just hold up? Jackie, please. Read me a minute. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. my fault. Why would you say that? She's trying to help me. It's my artwork. He hates it. Okay. If he doesn't want it, then we'll find someone else who will, okay? Sure we will. I don't want you to get any ideas. Your professional existence is merely to assist me. Right. I didn't hire you for your discerning judgment. I hired you because of your mother. Got it? Got it. I, I understand. Great. So, as my assistant, you should know that I don't deal with this trivial shit. Now, I'm going to leave, and you're going to tell your friends whatever you need to. All right, Carl, that's... Trivial shit? Jesus. My friend, I'm afraid you might be guilty of making a hasty judgment. Wow, this... Collection might be trivial now. It won't remain like that for long. Is that what you think? It's what I know. I've already had several dealers here today, and they didn't share your lack of enthusiasm. In fact, I already have several offers on the table. Who are you? Um, this is Sam's brother. Oh, no, 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 no. No, you're quite mistaken, madame. Quite mistaken. I am not Sam's brother, as everyone knows. Sam was raised in an orphanage in Paris. What? An orphanage in Paris? Of course. That's where Sam learned to paint. It's where I discovered. What's going on here, Susan? I have no idea. I, I thought this was his brother. <laughs> Sir, do you own your own gallery? Yes, a few. Perfect. What I'm looking for is exclusivity. I want a gallery to showcase only Sam's work and nothing else. I'm talking 30 to 40 original pieces. Are you nuts? It doesn't work like that. Shh. I don't think uh, my clientele would be interested in your <laughs> artist. Let me stop you there. I know you're thinking millions up front, but I am willing to negotiate a low six-figure deal to make this happen today. Are you mocking me? Excuse me? I told you. I forgot. I'm already in negotiations with several other dealers all in the low six-figure range. Well, then maybe you should take one of those deals. I think I will. Sam! Oh, shit. Uh, Finn, what are you doing in here? I believe he's negotiating on your behalf. Jesus okay. Christ, Sam, is that your toxicity? Yeah, don't worry about that right now. You're supposed to be in the bedroom. Let's go. Everything's OK, no, Sam. Please, can you do something yeah, about Maybe that? you should wait outside. All right, come me. on. Don't call me honey. Hey, will you help Thank me you. in the kitchen? I need Thank to you, Finn. Come on, Carl. Make Finn. me an offer. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. Thank you, Finn. I don't work that way. Okay. I will be back in a moment. Please, right. Carl, I am so sorry. No. I. Sir, I, I'm the one who's sorry. Look, uh, just please forget anything he just said. Just come in here and help me cut some cheese or something, OK? This, this You're wearing just... this tuxedo. I cannot believe I'm walking in this room. You learned to paint in an orphanage in France. What? I didn't think so. Is that your brother or not? Yes. That's what, why. What did he say? He said he was your agent and that he discovered you in Paris. Okay. No. That's that's not exactly. That's Are you not trying true. to scam me? Was this is this some sort of of hustle? No. To get no, me to buy your no, paintings? No. My brother. He gets confused. 
You've got very pretty eyes. Sir, <laughs> do, do, do you think that I would be fooled by this this this, this experience? No, no. You no. know what? You two are a bunch of nitwits. Oh, now I'm gonna reach around behind you and tie it, okay? I'm not trying to scam you. Okay, you're good. Now, you wanna help me cut some cheese? Just do it like I did, okay? See what I mean? It's like this. Hmm. Man, you wanna help me do this? No, 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 no. Not serve cheese and crackers. This is for peasants. The simplest thing I can say is that my brother, he has mental problems, mm. okay? He <laughs> makes up his own reality as he goes. I haven't even seen him in, in years, and he shows up at my door today, okay? So whatever he said, it's yeah. gotta be all part yeah. of some delusion that's going on in his brain. Do you see what I'm saying? I think this is a salad. Okay. This will make an excellent salad. I know what I'm talking about. This is rotten. He's gonna use rotten fruit. Well, well, yes. well, I'm honored to be part of, uh, of his brother's delusions. I mean, he fit in well here in LA, don't you think? Okay, look, there's no need for that. Cheese ball. It's for trailer park trash. You know what? I wish you luck with your brother and luck with your artwork. You're gonna need it. All right, well, well, thank you for the opportunity. No, I, I'm, I'm Wait, sorry you're so bothered by mental disorders. I'm sure you have no shit like that in your family. Sweetheart, why don't you go see what that is, and I'll continue with the salad. You know Thank you. I came out of here in a professional know, courtesy. I know. And, and, and not to watch some sort of schizophrenic episode. Not schizophrenic. I don't really care. But just so you know, he's not a schizophrenic. Let me just walk you out, Carl, and... Yeah. You stay. What the fuck, Sam? What the fuck was that? I'm it's sorry, I'm really that. sorry. Oh, it's okay. Jackie, he is my boss! He's an asshole. I have fucked up enough at work. I have to get fired. Fuck, I knew this wouldn't work. I thought I could try to impress him. What was that? I'm sorry. You guys have to fuck. down, Susan. What is wrong with him? God, why can't my life be normal for one night? No, 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 Susan, we, we don't smoke in here. Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, this is a small kitchen. <laughs> what can these condition? Shit. Man. See, I need some more vegetables, I think. I hope he's got some kind of collection. Uh. Sam! Sam, we have a refrigerator. It's just absolutely spare. I mean, there's just leftovers in here. You know, you don't really need to cook anything tonight. I've got dinner plans out, so, uh... Sam! I'm not gonna let you run off to a restaurant when you have a world-famous chef standing in your kitchen. Mom watched a lot of the Food Network. Oh my God, you should have seen her face when I won season four of Top Chef. I've never seen her so proud. Top Chef, huh? Sam, I know it's been a while since we've seen each other, but don't pretend like you didn't see me when season four. Actually, I don't think I had cable at that time. No, but Mom told me all about it. She was very proud. Sam, she's proud of you too. I mean, you're doing well here. Don't be too hard on yourself. Thanks. What are you supposed to do? Okay, we're just going to just pretend that nothing happened. Who's that? Susan! Carl? <sighs> this is awkward. I believe I left my cell phone here. Would you call it for me, please? Yeah, sure. Listen, when we were on the phone earlier, you said that Mom was with you. Yes? But she's not. She's not what? She's not here, man. She's not with you. Of course she's not with me, silly. <laughs> and why did you tell me she was? Why would you assume she was? I don't understand, Sam.
Forget it. This is like an interesting vegetable. What's going on? Carl wants his phone. Does anyone hear it? Yeah, I think I might have heard it over there. Did you really? You weren't even answering that. Jesus, what's he doing in there? So is it dinner for four then? Oh, Sam, he's gonna ruin your tux. Get another one. Dinner for four. No one is staying for dinner. What is wrong with you? Does anyone hear Carl's phone? Shh! Relax, Susan, we'll find it. I was really happy to hear. What's with her? I don't know, Ben. Did one of you take Carl's phone from the studio? No. No. We'll find it. Call it again, Susan. Are you sure you left it in here? I distinctly remember putting it right there. I remember placing it right here. And then your, your brother came in and it seemed to disappear. What's that supposed to mean? Why don't I ask your brother where my phone is? Look, don't accuse my brother of stealing your cell phone because you misplaced it. Look, you can turn my apartment upside down if you want. And if you don't find it, I'll buy you a new one. It's not the phone that I need. It's everything on it. So I'll say it again. Why don't we ask your brother where my phone is? He did not steal your cell phone, okay? I'm sorry that I wasted your time tonight, but obviously your cell phone is not here. So you can look all you want, and when you're done, you can let yourself out. Gentlemen, gentlemen, there's no need for argument. Let's, let's calm down here. Here's that, take a nice glass of wine. Carl, please, take a glass of wine. Here you go, Sam. Yes. Come on, Carl, drink some wine. Did you take my phone? Did I take your phone? Thank you, Sam. No, of course not. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. You know, I hate to be immodest at a time like this, but you really don't recognize me? This box again? I guess there's just too many big fish here in LA. Apparently. Uh, I won season two of Top Chef. I can't believe he doesn't recognize me. Look, Sam, why don't we hear about this later? Get back in the just kitchen. Just boss me around like the house cook, Sam. Oh, anyway, tomorrow is the grand opening of my restaurant. Don't forget. I said I'm going to be there. Oh, my God. You have to come, Carl. Right. I will put you on the list. He'll be there. All right, all right, Sam. I'll, I'll be back in a right, minute. Thanks. Is this, is this, is this bullshit? It's not bullshit. He had a car crash, okay? A couple years ago, he, he fell asleep at the wheel. He hit a telephone pole and went through the windshield. Doctors, they put him into some kind of coma and said he had brain damage. They said if he ever came out of it, he'd most likely have amnesia or behavioral differences. Well, he woke up. A couple days later, he started pretending to be a doctor, ordering around nurses and trying to evaluate patients. They concluded that he, he lost so many memories of his past that he has to make up new ones just to understand the present. And every time he gets confused, he makes himself into a new person. Dessert. I've got a plan for dessert. So it's like multiple personalities. Yes, but he's never the same person. He's always changing into someone new. I think I'm going to make some cake for dessert. So why did you just tell him who he really is? It's not that easy. He just refuses any reality but his own. So how do you handle it then? I don't know. I mean, it's my brother. Look, when you were here earlier, you really did believe that he was my agent. Just like right now, he really believes he is top chef. So he has no idea what he's doing in the kitchen? No, 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 no. No way in hell. How does he live? Like this. Here. And you take care of him? No, normally my mom does in New Jersey. Today he just showed up at my door. Is he retarded? I'll explain later. 
What's he doing here? Carl, that's what I'm trying to figure out. What was your name again? Sam. It is? Ben. I think I need to put this on the back one and just... Jesus. Jesus Christ! Look at this! We'll just look for it later. Just needs a little bit more spice. A little bit more. Have some salt. So what is this caramel sauce? I don't know. Up there. I feel like I'm performing in front of a live TV audience. Hello, everyone. Now, today on the King Food Show, we'll be preparing a fresh farm duck breast with king oyster mushrooms covered in a Bordelais sauce. Now, the reduction is the most important part. Ooh, that. That's why I'm here, sweetheart. So, uh, top chef. How soon till dinner's ready? I knew you'd come around, Carl. Are we staying for dinner? Of course you are, sweetheart. So, why don't you guys grab a glass of wine and relax? I've got another 25 minutes of the show to take. What's the show? I'm just messing with you, sweetheart. Go on and relax. Sam, come on, he's right in the kitchen. Hey, Mmm. Come on. Would you like to try some? I'll clean it's... it later. Mm. All right. You'll get it later. You know, you guys don't really have to stick around. Oh, I don't mind. I'm hungry anyway. Yeah, but there's not even going to be any dinner. He's not cooking what he's talking about. Not Meg. Yeah. I can see that. Look, I don't mean to be rude, but maybe you guys should just leave. Yeah, and take me. I really don't mind. I want to see how this turns out. Carl, well, what are we going to do about your phone? It'll turn up. So, Susan tells me you guys are getting married. Yay. Yeah. Hmm. When's the wedding? Next uh, weekend. Oh, well, congratulations. Maybe that's why Finn's here. Oh, my God. That's why your brother's here. No, honey, he doesn't know about the wedding. How do you know that? Your mom could have told him. She wouldn't do that. He's going to ruin the wedding. Coconut oil. <laughs> this will give it a nice tropical flavor. No shit. He's not going to ruin the wedding if he doesn't know about the wedding. He's already ruining the wedding. Are you nervous? Yes, he's burning pots in there. He's going to burn this whole place down. I meant about the wedding. Oh, sorry. Not really. My mom and my sisters, they planned the whole thing, so I didn't have to worry too much. It's just, uh, you know, stressful. Take those next <sighs> big steps. Sometimes it feels like you're being pushed. Well, marriage is difficult. All those vows to fulfill, a bunch of impossibilities. Sam. <clears throat> I need to see the two of you in my office now, please. Finn, is dinner ready yet? Sam, now. Finn. Jackie, you two, both of you come along in my office. Five minutes. Come on, five minutes. I am not missing this. You go back in the studio and find my phone. If I find my phone, you're not fired. So right, right here, Jackie. Right here. Yes. Now, Jackie, I need you to work with me with this. And uh, what is it that's stressing you out right now? What? 
Well, you said there were more important things in the wedding that were stressing you out. What are they? What are you doing? Sam, we all have stress in our lives, but if one partner suffers too much from it, it can cripple the relationship. Now, if I know what stresses Jackie out, I can teach her how to reduce it, and everyone benefits. Carl, it isn't in there. I, I don't know where it is. Can we just get out of here now, please? Shh. I think you're interrupting what appears to be a therapy session. Doctor, will you please tell me your credentials? Well, if that's what's important to you, <laughs> I have a PhD in clinical psychology from Princeton. I have a private practice in New Jersey, and I have successfully treated over 10,000 couples. So you're a marriage counselor? I like to think of myself as a relationship doctor. <laughs> well, that's cute. Carl, what I'm trying to do is serious, and if you can't be quiet, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. I'm not doing this. Uh, hey, come on. Uh, we, we, we must all work together on this, Jackie. We can't do this alone, Sam. Jackie must continue her treatment. I understand. God damn it, Sam, look in the kitchen. Hey, I said I got it. Just come on. I know this is very difficult for you, but it's important that we continue this. Well, Finn, somebody has to clean up your mess. Jackie, you wanting to clean the kitchen right now is a classic example of avoidance behavior. He's right. You are avoiding the questions. Look at the fucking kitchen. Check. You know what? Susan, go clean the kitchen. What? Go clean the kitchen. <laughs> You're kidding, right? Look, I'm here because of you. And you lost my phone. So I'm going to sit here and listen to the sage advice of our relationship doctor while you go clean the kitchen. Oh, and be there and get me some more wine. Please. Come, come, Jackie. Come, come. Come on. Come on. Come on. That's good. That's a good girl. There you go. That's not so difficult, was it? Now, we need to calmly resolve some of the issues that you and Sam are having. Who says we're having issues? No. Sam, what have you been saying? If anyone should be complaining around here, it's me. I didn't say anything. Oh, okay, tell me. Let's not make accusations. This is stupid, I'm not doing this. What could you possibly be writing? Now, Jackie, your refusal to deal with these problems is probably why the two of you are here. I have a feeling that it's your typical pattern to bottle up your feelings until they finally explode in a negative manner. This is what we're trying to avoid. You're crazy. Someone's not coming along. Are you guys serious? Honey, come on. Come on. Tell him something. Yeah. You want me to tell him something? Yeah. Fine. Maybe I'm stressed because my fiance quit his paying job as a graphic designer to become a painter. Here we go. This is a great start, Jackie. Great start. Now, Sam, when did you quit your job? Uh, well, Doc, it's been about six months. It was nine months ago. Okay. So this is a single earning household then? Yes, I pay for everything. Shit does not pay for everything. Really? When was the last time you paid rent? Or a bill? Do you even know what bills we pay? For Christ's sake, Sam, I pay your fucking cell phone bill. Okay, I think we're a little off topic, right? Now. I we think we're making progress here. Being a sole earner in a household can create an incredible amount of pressure. No, mother, I I'm leaving. No, I, I don't want to stay anymore. Mom, he's making me wash Jackie's dishes. Jackie, is there anything that Sam can do to help alleviate some of that pressure? He could get a job, or at least help out around the house. 
Is this true, Sam? Do you not help around the household? He doesn't do shit. He stays up all night drinking wine and painting. But <laughs> lately, it seems like the only thing coming out of your studio is empty bottles. And have you been drinking a lot? Let's just, let's stop, okay? You're upsetting. I think we should continue. I don't even care that you don't wake up in the morning. But now I'm starting to think that you just sit around and watch TV all day while I'm at work. Now, what makes you suspect this, Jackie? Because he hasn't made any progress. <laughs> and then when I ask you why you haven't made me progress, you say that I'm stupid and that obviously I don't understand how hard it is to do what you're doing. That is not fair. So, Sam does not hold down a job, does not help with the chores around the house, and insults you when he's challenged. Oh, and you two are going to wed in a week. Well, let me just say, I don't think this is a very good idea. That's another thing. Maybe <laughs> I'm worried because my mother keeps calling me and telling me that everyone will understand if I cancel the wedding. Strong words from a mother-in-law, Sam. Did she really say that? I can't that? believe I'm doing this. <sighs> Maybe I'm stressed because I'm about to marry a guy whose brother is obviously fucked up. Hey, I completely understand. Good for you, Jackie. Fuck you, Susan. I think this is a good time to end the session. We've accomplished a lot tonight. We'll address Sam's alcoholism at a later date. <laughs> well, thanks a lot, buddy. You're welcome. What the fuck are you writing? Lovely. Jackie is obviously suffering from a mild psychosis brought on by an unwillingness to stop in the doomed wedding. <laughs> I'll be right back. This is fucking bullshit. I'm a, and I'm, a, I'm your assistant. I'm not your bitch, you know? Like, there's a huge difference. There's a huge difference between being someone's bitch and being someone's assistant. What are you doing? Are you serious? Get off of me. You can't be that upset. My brother's gonna leave tomorrow. Did you listen to anything I just said? Yeah, I listened. I was serious. I listened, and you shouldn't have said that stuff in front of Carl. <gasps> Gives a shit about Carl! I do. He's still here, isn't he? Which means he might use my stuff. <laughs> Don't be an idiot, Sam. He doesn't care about your art. He's just here for the fucking freak show. Would you like a glass of wine? Oh, no, thank you. I never drink on the jab. You are amazing, Ben. Is, is this just a game? Or is there really something wrong with you? I'm sorry, do you have me confused with someone else? Mm -mm. It is you that has yourself confused with someone else. I know things have been rough. I mean, you've been basically supporting us both. I know that, and thank you, I'm sorry. But if he sells my stuff, things are gonna turn around, I promise. Too much hope in that happening. Well, what do you want me to do? You want me to just give up like you did? What's that mean? What did I give oh, come up? Come on, you hate your job. You hate everyone there. All you do is complain. You just come home and complain. It sucks. <laughs> I'm not doing this. I'm leaving. I'm sorry, okay? All right, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. I don't even care. I just don't want to be here tonight. Just stay here. Have fucking quality time with your brother like you always wanted. You know what I want? I can't get anymore. Come on. Tell me. How does your brain work? I mean, are you aware that you're making things up, or do you really believe that you're a psychologist? I'm not sure what you're referring to. That's right. You're not agent from Paris. Oh, no, no. Oh, sorry, sorry. Forgive me. You're a famous cook. You won Top Chef. I forgot to con congratulate you. I don't know what you're talking about. Why don't you be a cocktail waitress and get me another drink, huh? You know, that brings up a really important point. Have you ever played the part of a female or all your characters male? How does that work? So, no to the cocktail waitress? <laughs>
It's all right, it's all right. I got my own. Susan, will you come in here, please? Be okay? Don't worry about me. You should be worried about what you're gonna do about him and where your mom is. Fuck. Mm -hmm. Time to go? Not quite. Get me another glass of wine, will you? You know who you should be next? You should be the artist. You're obviously the talented one. I'm sorry. Do we know each other? <laughs> <laughs> who knows? Maybe. You were the cop that pulled me over for speeding this morning. Carl, I think it's time for us to go. Um, how do you know that he didn't do something to her? He wouldn't hurt my mom. He's harmless. You fucking oh, hey, hey, hey. You fucking hey, hey, hey. You don't fucking hey, hey, hey. You don't hey, 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 come here. Come here, Finn. What are you doing, man? Get in my bed. Get in my room. This is no motherfucker. Yeah. Calm down. Fucking Sunny Norman, calm down, man. Fucking Norman, stay on the Okay, okay. Sit. All right. Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Susan. Susan. She doesn't know me. She doesn't know me. I know. They don't know you. No one knows you. Hey, I gotta go back out there. Please, just, just sit here. Susan, we're leaving. She's not going anywhere until she finds my phone. Carl, I don't know where it is. Let's just go. I need it. You find it. I agree. It's gonna be okay. Finn, it's gonna be okay. Okay, Sam, if you say so. Just stay here, man. No, don't leave, Sam. Don't leave. Susan, this is so embarrassing. Come on. Jackie, just give me one minute. Oh, my God. Okay. okay. Jackie, can I talk to you just for a minute? Jackie, please. No, we're leaving. Come on, Susan. Jackie, just give me one more minute. Okay? Fine. Carl. Right you fucking know me. Fucking kiss me. You know me. Speak to the, the detective for crimes. It's not here, Carl. I'm leaving. Where's the wine? Susan and I are leaving. When Carl wants to stay and I get drunk and fuck with your brother, it's fine. Susan's not going anywhere until she finds my phone. Carl, I don't know where your phone is. Why don't the two of you look for the cell phone and just give me a chance to talk to her for like five minutes? Oh, no, absolutely not. Wait! Jesus! Wait, no one's going anywhere until right, we finish down. the fucking deal. Finn, calm down. You, get you all need to hey, get the fuck down. down. Get to the bedroom. What is wrong? Get on the couch with you. Hey. He came here to hey, make a deal. Tonight is done. Okay? Not yet. You came here to make a deal. So let's make it. Should I call you Carlos? Hey, Finn, tonight. do you realize that you ruined this entire evening Jackie, for your brother? Come no, I'm over babying him. Just sit down. Backups here. 
Who knocks on my door like that? You need to get a handle on your I, brother. I, He's I, fucking crazy. I won't get a hold of him. You just calm down for like five minutes, all right? Hold on. Finn, don't open it. Finn, don't open it. Hey, boys, the drug dealer's upstairs. Come on. Sir, take a step back, please. Take a step back. Get a call what the fuck is it? Don't look at me. We're leaving. Come on. Shh. Whoa. Hold on, Winston. You guys sit down with oh. the other ones. Guys, oh my God. let me do the talking, boys. This gentleman here is in the process of selling 10 kilo of cocaine to this resident junkie Finn, here. what are you talking about? Stop, stop, all right? Oh, just, okay. everyone, take a seat. Yeah, sit, sit down. down. Sit seat. down, you whore. Don't look at me. Don't. Sir, I need you to remain silent until I speak to you, OK? Did you call us? No. No, I didn't. So I'm assuming you called. Yeah, I called you. I just needed some backup. If I were known you're going to fuck it up so badly, I would just take him down myself. Dude, shut up. You shut up, you crackhead. Relax. Here's the situation. Obviously, he called. He said there were legal activities going on at this address. Sir, some drug trafficking and prostitution. Oh, 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 yeah, just, just look at him. They're about. obviously okay. whores. Fuck you! Oh, Get the know. fuck out of our house! Everyone yeah. shut up! Continue. Yeah, continue. Why'd you call us? I've been running surveillance on this location for two months now. This guy is a nobody middleman junkie. Forget about him. This guy is a major dealer for the Mexican Mafia. Hey, do you have a badge, some form of identification? Look, boys, I'm deep undercover here. You think I carry a badge with me? Who is this guy, a rookie? Guys, this is all a misunderstanding. Look, if you just give me a minute to explain. OK, hold on, hold on. This badge. This is Officer 542 at address 55 okay. Orange. Just checking to see if there's any ongoing investigations over. You think this badge is going to know about me? I'm DEA, Special Agent Clements. Um, Guys, it's obvious you're way in over your heads here. We need to wrap this operation up, but tonight it would be a major fuck up for your precinct if these bozos walk. Sir, I need you to stop talking. You lack of cooperation. We'll be going in my report. Stop talking. Hey, rookie, why don't you go check the bedroom? You'll find 10 kilos and a loaded firearm in the top drawer. Will you shut the fuck up? Shut up, junkie. This is dispatch on 5-4. Go ahead, dispatch. Can't any operations running at your address? Of course not. What's going on here? It's, it's a dinner party, guys. That's it. And these are my friends. That's it. There's him. nothing illegal going on here. Who's he? That's my brother. He's obviously very confused right now. Never listen to a cokehead. Rule number one at the precinct. Great. We got a 5150. Who are they? <sighs> She's my fiance. Whore. Fuck you. Stop. These are my friends. They're here to see my artwork. Prostitute, pimp, really big pimp right here. What's he talking about? I don't know. He's delusional. He, he gets very mixed up. Are you just going to listen to this dirtbag? Check the bedroom. You'll know who the real liar is. Shut up, Finn. You shut up. What's in the bedroom? Nothing, guys. He's making it up. He's making it up. I need to bust for you guys. You just have to go in there and look. Sir, do you consent to a search of your bedroom? No, absolutely not. There's no need for you to do that. Why not? There's nothing there. Sam, just let them look. No, Jackie, they don't have the right. Ma'am, do you live here also? Yeah. Do you have consent for us to uh, search your bedroom? Yeah, go ahead. No, Jackie, don't do that. They, they can't, they, they can't, no, they can't go problem? through our personal stuff. All right, let's go ahead and search. Yeah, you need to look in the top. Oh, okay, that's enough, that's enough. Yes, sir. 10 kilos of cocaine coming right up. You know, I could arrest you for impersonating an officer, and I can also arrest you for filing a false police report. Do you understand that? You know, I could arrest you for interfering with a federal investigation. I don't know about 10 kilos, but I got a gram of coke and a loaded handgun. What the fuck? Oh, I didn't get to see that half of the party. That was in the dresser drawer? OK, ma'am, hold on, hold on. Whose gun is this? Obviously, it's theirs. Are there any other firearms on the premises? No. Not that. Is this your cocaine? Are you fucking kidding me, Sam? Oh. It's not a big deal. It's not. It's kind of a big deal. It's kind of a big deal. No. Are you doing coke by yourself? I wouldn't be the first dealer who's a user. Is there anything else you want to tell me? No. OK. Let's switch the rest of the place. 
Look, this is how this is gonna work. This house comes back clean. I'm gonna have to arrest you for the possession of an illegal firearm and the possession of a controlled substance. Whoa, 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 whoa. These are my suspects. I'm taking them into custody. Has he been using cocaine tonight? No, no. Have you? Yeah. Yes, but you it was tonight? hours ago. Tonight? You're fucking disgusting. Do you know that? Officer, I don't like to be the first guy to leave a party, but uh, it's past my bedtime, so if you don't mind, I'll be leaving. Yeah, I'd like to leave, too. Oh. Just, 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 there's got to be one or two hundred thousand dollars here. Oh, oh my God. God. Oh, my God. Enough to buy ten kilos of Coke, huh? All right, yeah. The young you boys finally starting to smell the coffee now. Look, I don't know what's going on here, but but I'm leaving. Okay? Hey, if you don't sit down now, I'm gonna put you down, you understand? Yeah, it's gonna put you down. All right, so let's start this all over again, shall we? Does anybody want to tell me what is really going on? I'm telling you, this here's the deal or that's his cash. <laughs> that's not mine. The sir. Rest. I don't know what's going on here, officer, and I don't really know these people, but that's definitely not my cash. He's a liar. He's one of the biggest movers on the West Coast. Give me a rest, will you, Ben? Whose cell phone is this? No, that's... Booyah! Undisputable proof. You want to tell me what it's doing in the middle of a bag of money that's not yours? Probably because this moron stole it and put it in there. Sir, I'm going to ask you one more time. Whose money is this? Are you serious? Do you really believe this idiot? Well, so far, yes. It seems as if he's the only one that's making sense around here. Yeah. Isn't that your Hey, 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 is there something you want to tell the rest of us here? Finn. Come on, man. Someone needs to show you the harsh arm of the law. Hey, rookie, tase this junkie. I'm going to tase you if you don't shut up. Please do. I'm going to assume this is your money. You're the only one that knew where it was, and no one else here is claiming it. She turn around. What? Are you crazy? You can't just you can't arrest me. Do you, do you know who I am? You're gonna lose your badge for this, you stupid rookie. Do you even know what DEA stands for? Just get away from me. You can't. Oh, 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 God, that's so tight. Uh, that hurts. Uh, Ow. Sam. It's mine. What? It's yours. What the fuck have I been telling you guys? Yeah. Where did you get this much money? I sold some paintings. You sold some paintings? Yeah. To who? A private collector. And he paid you in cash? Yes. He, he said something about not wanting to pay taxes or something. I bet he did. He did? He came here. He, he bought most of my best work. He said he was going to take it to Paris and sell it for millions. Look, he, he gave me a bunch of cash, and then he took off, and that's it. You really expect me to believe this bullshit? No. It's the truth. Kid, if you don't start being straight with me right now, you're going to be spending more than one night in jail. Uh, wait a minute, officer. Uh, I think I know this, that this, this French man. Was his name Francois? Francois Faux? Francois, yes, that's him. That's him. I know of him. He's a type to, to fly into our country and, and abscond off with, with great new uh, American artist collections. And he would pay this much money? Who is this kid? Oh, this is a rising star. Sarge, I'm not finding anything. I'm going to call in the canine unit? Yeah, call in the dogs. I'm telling you, there's really nothing here, guys. There's nothing here. Except for cocaine, a loaded gun, and, and a bunch of money. What do you want to do? What else do you guys need? Arrest them. Nothing. There's nothing here. What? Go ahead and uncuff them. You know what? I don't know what your problem is, but if you call us and give us a false report, I'm going to arrest you. You got that? What, you're buying into their bullshit story? We need to tear this place apart and do a real goddamn search. You need to get him some real help. I will. I'm close to declaring him a threat. No, I'll get him some help. Look, if you could just leave him out of this tonight, I, I would really appreciate it. Look, my mom is going to kill me if he gets arrested. Just please. All right, turn around. Let's put your hands behind your back. Finally. Can't you go easy on him? I mean, he's not the first artist to resort to cocaine. Yeah, you know, but he's also got a loaded gun. What do you want to do with this? Uh, 
Let's take the coke and the uh, the gun in for evidence. I'll be a nice guy. I'll leave this money here for them. Can you just give me one more minute with him? I, I just really need to make sure he's going to be OK. Make it quick. Finn, come here. Finn, I'm leaving now. But so is everyone else. That means you're gonna have to stay here alone tonight. Can you promise me you won't leave until I get back? The only thing I can promise you is this investigation is not over. <laughs> you are not an undercover cop. I am not a drug dealer. You're not a marriage counselor or the top chef or whatever else you have stored in your brain. You're just my brother. That's it. Do you remember when we were little kids? You used to take care of me. You used to do my homework for me. You made sure no one ever fucked with me. Did you just be that guy again? My older brother. <laughs> just stay here until I get back, OK? What, what, what do you want me to do here? I need you to watch over my artwork. Make sure nothing happens to me. What's going to happen to him? Nothing. Not if you stay here and watch over it. You need me to guard him. I need you to stay here and guard it. I will do that. Thank you. Thank you. OK, just come get me in the morning. You have the right to remain silent. Carl, Anything you say you can time. and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right Carl. to an attorney. Sure I enjoyed go. myself. I don't want to get to do anything to these paintings. Stand here. I need another glass of wine. Really? You stand here? Carl, doesn't the matter of you think you should leave too? In a minute. I want to take another look at Sam's artwork. The wind. Get the fuck out of the hey, way. Hey, it's really nice that you came. You ruined everything. No one's getting in until Sam gets back. You know what, Finn? I just need to grab my jacket. Let her buy. No one is getting in. Finn, this is my house. Sorry. Let me get by. No can do. What the fuck is wrong with whoa, you? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Such a fucking loser. Me? Do you know why you're like this? Do you? Because you tried to kill yourself. You were a drunk fucking loser who ate Vicodins all day and you tried to kill yourself by driving your car into a tree. Did you know that? Did you know that? I tried to kill myself. Bullshit. And instead of just dying and doing your family a favor, you ended up like this. A delusional fucking jerk off. Oh. OK. Um. Let's go. No, what about your coat? Let's just go. Hold on, wait. Hold on. So you got yourself a new job, huh? Sir, we are closing soon. You need to finish your drink and make your way out. I gotta start looking for a new job. I can't work for that asshole anymore. Hey, where are you going? My car's this way. No, I gotta check something out. What are you doing? I have to check something out. What the fuck is that smell?
think I gotta stay with you for a few days. Fuck. Sir, you cannot stay here. We are closing for the night. You know, your brother seems to think that he's doing the right thing by treating you like an idiot. Let's all play along with Finn's fantasy so he doesn't get upset. That's what he told me. <laughs> and look what that got him tonight. Well, I guess that's justice. Sir, do you need me to escort you out? Oh, can't you see that your brother is just controlling you? He's trying to manipulate you. Come on, this, this is not you, Finn. You should be the one who's in control. Not your brother. Sir, please. It is so obvious that you are the talented one. Okay? I mean, look at his artwork. It's, it's terrible. It's, it's tasteless. It, it's thoughtless. It's talentless. You're not the card, Finn. You're the artist. Think about it, Finn. Think about it. I mean, your brother, he's a con artist, but he's only conning himself. He needs help, Finn. He needs your help. I don't think so. I'm gonna stay with Susan for a little while. Why? Because I don't want to deal with that right now. Come on, it's now or never. Yeah, I understand that. What does that mean? Never? I don't want to talk about this right now. Fine, we don't have to talk about it right now. Give me my mom's keys. Look, you don't need me in there. I could really use your help. I don't want to go near him, okay? He's been driving around with a buffalo head in the trunk of his car. He's fucking scary. He's off his meds, Jackie. It'll take a couple days, but I'll sort it out. You have to deal with your brother. That's your family. He's gonna be your family too, you know? No, he'll never be my family. I'm sorry, but... I mean, what's your plan with him? What if he did something to your mother? What are you gonna do then? I don't know. I'll figure it out. That's the thing, you never have a plan. And then something's gonna happen and he'll end up living with us. What do you want me to do, put him in an institution? I'm not. I'm not gonna do it. Well, I'm not gonna live with him. What is your problem? Listen, you're gonna need to contact everyone on your side and tell them that the wedding is off. Jackie, you're freaking out, okay? You're just, you're getting freaked right now. No, this has already started. 
My mom is handling everything. You just need to contact your invites. What are you talking about? It's not just about your brother, you know that. I just need some time alone right now. That's it? We're done? Sam, you need to figure out what you're gonna do. Because obviously right now this isn't working. You're basically living off of me. You're doing coke by yourself. And I'm sorry, but I don't think this art thing's gonna work out for you. I mean, I don't see a future there. So fucked up. Where have you been? No. No. Who sends postcards anymore? Finn! Hold on, Mom. I don't know. It must have gone straight through. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, he's here. Let me get him. Mom, let me call you back. Did you talk to mom? Jesus. Finn, what are you doing? I've been planning your trip all night. You've been Finn. painting all night. Finn, did you talk to mom? Yeah, I talked to her. She's fine. All right. They gave me proof of life, but we got to get the money there in two days. Proof of Finn. life? What are you talking about? Sam, yeah, just get in. Sam, look. Mom's on vacation. That's just so they can mail the ransom note. Finn, this is your handwriting. No, it's not. They use invisible ink and it develops in vinegar. OK, look, why don't we just go back inside? I'm really tired. I got the money right here. We need to get it to her. We need to save Mom. Come on. Get in. Come on, Sam. Come on. Come on. 